the S&P 500, ticker symbol SPY. In this video, we're going over my trade idea of the week and the day-by-day -day probability model. So let's start off with the technical analysis on the 1R chart. We remain in negative MACD. We did see a diverge. We're slightly off of oversold levels with the RSI. We have yet to close above the 200 moving average, the screen line, at a rent price of $451.82, acting as our temporary resistance. As with the 4 hour chart, we remain in negative MACD and approaching to oversold condition with the RSI. As we extend that further to the daily chart, we are in pause MACD. As with the trade idea, my position size for it is less than 1% of my portfolio. My long entry is at $435.78, my sell target is at $456.22, and my stop loss is at $428.75. However, if I were to open a short position, my entry is at $462.18, my sell target is at $443.02, and my stop loss is at $468.32. So how did I develop these trade ideas? It all comes from the day-by-day -day probability model. As we progress to the fifth day or week of trading, the S&P 500 has a 52% chance to climb between 0 to 3% and a 3% chance to climb between 3 to 6%. To the downside, it has a 42% chance to fall between 0 to negative 3% and a 3% chance to fall between negative 3 to negative 6%. So if you enjoyed its content, feel free to like, comment, subscribe, and thank you for watching.